Airbus 320 Walk Around Training Program. Check that the fuel panel door are closed. Check that the magnetic fuel level indicators are flush with the wing. And check that there are no leaks from the fuel water drain valve. Check the condition of the landing light. And check slat 1 is not damaged. And check position is in accordance with the slats flaps lever position. Check that all the doors are closed and latched. Check that the drain mask is in good condition, with no significant leaks. And check the engine inlet and the fan blades are not damaged. And check that all doors are closed and latched. And check that the turbine exhaust is clean. Check the pylon for condition. Check that its access panels are closed. Check the condition of the slats. Check that the fuel level indicators are flush with the wing. Check there is no leak from the fuel water drain valves. Check that fuel coupling door are closed. Verify that the surge tank air inlet is clear and that the overpressure disc is not missing. Check that the navigation lights and the wingtip are not damaged. Check the top of fuselage antennas. On the wing, check the static dischargers are not broken or missing. Check that the fairings, flaps and control surfaces are not damaged. Check that the chocks have been removed. Check the wheels and tires for wear, cuts or cracks. With the parking brake on, check the brakes for wear and their brake wear indicators. Check the torque link damper and the hydraulic lines for condition. Check the landing gear main structure and the down lock springs. Check the safety pin is removed. On the fuselage, check the yellow ground hydraulic connection door must be closed and the shroud fuel drain must be clear of leaks. According to the loading operations, check that the cargo door and its selector panel are closed and latched. Check the bulk door Check toilet service access door. Check the potable water service panel. Check the conditions of the outflow valve and the drain mast. Check the closure of the flight recorder access door. Check that the right hand stabilizer and elevator are not damaged. Check the fin and the rudder. Check that all the static dischargers are in good condition. 